One man who has returned to England to try and stop a film deal is ex-Sex Pistol John Lydon. As we reported a few weeks ago on 120, Lydon is enraged at what he calls an invasion of privacy by British director Alex Cox's new movie, Sid and Nancy. The film's based on the life and death of former Sex Pistol Sid Vicious and his girlfriend Nancy Spungen. A source is close to Cox say Lydon walked out of a showing of the movie and has filed a motion in British courts to stop the film from being released in the U.S. The film, Sid and Nancy, uh, received rave reviews at the Cannes Film Festival in May and is slated for a North American release at the New York Film Festival in September. A side note to all this is that Vicious's mother was an advisor on the picture, and John Lydon talked to MTV recently about the downfall of his former band member. Sid was a very innocent chap. Uh, he tended to be naive and he believed what was written about him, which was unfortunate because it destroyed him. And I don't want to see that abused. Ex-Clash frontman and Leiden cohort Joe Strummer also contributes to the film. He wrote and uh, performed the title tune, which will be available on MCA Records in a few weeks. If love does kill, you'll need a healthy dose of doctor and the medics coming right up after the break with their UK camp rock smash spirit in the sky.